Hi, I'm Frank, and these are the top five reasons why I think you should consider moving to the Isle of Man. Hi there, so my name is Frank or Amadeus IOM on YouTube and I have been living on the Isle of Man on and off for around 20 years. I first came here in August 2000. I still remember stepping off the Ben McCree on one early Sunday morning. Um, I lived here for a decade after that, a bit more than that, then decided to move around the world a little for work and recently returned to live here again. When I returned here, I realized that the place has a lot of things going for it that I never really appreciated when I wasn't here. And it took, you know, moving around the world and seeing and living in other cultures and places to really appreciate all the things the island has to offer. So I decided to do a little video outlining five very unscientific reasons in no particular order why I think the Isle of Man is a great place to consider if you are thinking about moving somewhere else. And it doesn't matter if you're in the UK right now or in Europe or further afield. This little island in the Irish Sea has a lot to offer to anyone who's looking for a really nice and pleasant place to live. So without further ado, here are my top five reasons why you should consider moving to the Isle of Man. Okay, the first great thing about the Isle of Man, in my opinion, is its people. And by that I mean simply the people who live here. The Isle of Man is a very small place. It has somewhere between 85 and maybe by now 90,000 people living here. And therefore, it's not much bigger than, you know, maybe a city elsewhere. And as a result of being so small, it does have a very community feel to it. Now, I know that's a cheesy and often overused term, but here it really applies. It feels more like a village than a country which you know in in its own respect it is people here are incredibly friendly incredibly welcoming helpful polite and it's really it's just a delight to to interact here and to live here even in in small everyday things you know you go to the shop or you're in town or you're driving and and everyone's just so nice and polite and they help you and they're honest if you lose something you get it back so there's a real feeling of of community here and that comes from it being such a small place and from you know pretty much everyone knowing everyone of course there are down points to that at some point but generally it is really one of the nicest things and you only realize how nice people are once you've been away for a while and you come back here and you realize yeah this is an incredibly friendly place to live so number one on my list of great things about the Isle of Man is definitely its people Now, friendly people are good and well, but you still need some money in your pocket if you want to live here. That's why the second great thing about the Isle of Man is its relatively low taxes. Especially compared to places like the UK, the Isle of Man compares very favorably. The new budget was released just recently, and at the moment, the single allowance stands at £14,250 or £28,500 for couples. The next £6,500 after that are taxed at 10% income tax, and anything after that is taxed at 20%. This goes up until an income of £200,000 because yes, we have an income tax cap. So as far as the income tax is concerned, you never pay more than 20%. That of course is a lot less than you would pay in somewhere like the UK where a better earning individual can very quickly find himself paying 30, 40 or even more percent in income tax. Also, if you do happen to run a business, you will be pleased to know that the Isle of Man has no corporation tax, unless you run a bank, and it also has no capital gains tax. Finally, if you are in line to inherit something, you will be pleased to know there is no inheritance tax either. All of that really makes it a very attractive place to live, and it actually makes it, as far as that's possible, a place where it's kind of fun to pay your taxes, because it feels fair and it feels appropriate. And if ever you have a problem with your taxes, then the tax office, which is based in this building behind me, is very approachable and always happy to help. I know that firsthand because I had to go there recently to sort out my own taxes. They were really approachable. There was nothing scary about it. And it's not an anonymous big building. It's a tiny office with four desks. You go there, you wait five minutes, you speak to them, and you get it all sorted. 
this comes again down to the sort of community spirit. So yes, the second nice thing about the Isle of Man is its low tax rate. Also, the island has slightly higher average income than the UK, although that sometimes has to be offset with the sometimes higher cost of living you experience here. I will touch on that in more detail in a future video. But for now, my second favorite bit about the Isle of Man is its low taxes. great reason to consider moving to this place is the fact that the Isle of Man is ridiculously safe. Crime rates here are way lower than anything you would find in the UK or most other parts of the world. I remember reading an internet study recently that claimed the Isle of Man is the third safest country on earth after Monaco and Liechtenstein. I don't know how scientifically or statistically sound that study was, but I wouldn't be at all surprised if it turned out to be true. This island doesn't only feel safe, it actually is safe. Whatever crime we do get is kept in check by the ladies and gentlemen in the building behind me here in Douglas, and it's usually petty crime. Most of it is referred to alcohol and drugs, and you wouldn't feel or see any of it in everyday life. Really serious crimes such as car thefts or scooter gangs, stabbings, shootings, that kind of thing, it's virtually unheard of. Whenever we do have something like a car theft, this is usually how it happens. The police will post on Facebook that someone has stolen a car. One hour later, the police will post on Facebook that the car has been found with an empty tank a few streets down the road. What happened is that some drunk didn't fancy the cab fare and found a car with the key in the ignition which, because it's a safe place, people sometimes, unfortunately, still do. There aren't really any professional gangs here stealing cars because you can't get the car off the island. As a pleasant side effect, the Isle of Man has some of the lowest car insurance rates in the whole of the British Isles. In fact, I remember reading that Douglas is the cheapest postcode for car insurance simply because if you steal a car here, you can't really take it anywhere. So the third great thing about the Isle of Man is really the fact that it is so super safe and that really adds a lot to your quality of life. The fourth reason why I think you should consider moving to the Isle of Man is the fact that the place is quite pretty and clean. With that I mean a number of things. Not only has it beautiful countryside that is free for everyone to explore and because of the relatively low population density we actually still get a lot of green fields and forests and beaches and glens and parks that you can wander around without seeing too many other people. But it also looks after the place relatively well. There are hundreds of miles of footpaths you can explore, there are bicycle paths, there are plantations to go through, adventure parks, there's all sorts of things to do in the outdoors and if you like that kind of thing you'll be absolutely thrilled here. It's also a very clean place and that starts with things such as air quality. I've lived in places such as Athens and Manila where air quality really hits you the moment you step off the plane, you just cannot breathe. Every time I step off the plane here on the island, I notice how clean and crisp the air is. And even if I just come over from London, you really, really feel the difference. Also because it is such a nature surrounded place and such a green and sort of rural place, you don't get hit by the sort of concrete grayness that some big cities bring. Everything is much greener, much more connected to nature and that really adds to your quality of life in ways that are maybe not immediately obvious but the longer you live here the more you will feel relaxed and at ease and you will feel the benefits of living in a place that has very clean air. Also the Isle of Man was made a UNESCO biosphere back in 2016 I believe it was and it's the first whole jurisdiction to receive that honor. On top of that it also has 26 dark sky sites so if you are into stargazing, then this is the perfect place for you because light pollution is relatively low. So on top of all that, really, this is a place for anyone who loves nature or anyone who doesn't yet know that he really should have more nature in his or her life. The fact it's such a green and pretty and clean place is definitely one of the reasons why you should consider moving here. The fifth and final thing on my list of great things about the Isle of Man is simply its slower pace of life. This also manifests itself again in everyday situations such as when you're at the shop or the post office and the lady behind the counter takes a good time to talk to the grandma picking up her pension or buying her milk. At first you kind of want to go get on with it 
but then you realize that it's actually quite nice that we still make time for this kind of thing that we talk to each other and that we have a community spirit also when you come here it will take you some time to adjust to it especially if you come from a big city and a 24 7 everything right here right now environment life here works at a slower pace you will have a lot less stress you will feel less rushed the shops aren't open 24 7 and at first maybe that will sort of be irritating but once you get used to it you will come to appreciate it because you live a more relaxed less stressed more mellow lifestyle which is very good for your health again and let's face it we sometimes rush for absolutely no reason at all and a place like this kind of helps us to be a bit more relaxed be a bit more easygoing and that's simply very very nice and not something we kind of tend to have in today's society anymore so my fifth favorite thing about this island is simply its slower pace of life which means you can lead a healthier more relaxed life with less stress and less things to be angry about okay i did say i'm going to do the top five reasons to move here but there's no way that i can leave a video about the reasons to move here without mentioning the Isle of Man TT races. Now this motorbike race that happens at the end of May and beginning of June and then again there's the classic TT in August, it has shaped the island in many many ways and there are many people who love it, there are quite a few who don't like it. I will do a separate episode on the TT races soon because it's just too big a topic to just you know mention it here but I wanted to give it an honorable mention. If you're into motorbikes, if you're into motorsport, and if you love, you know, riding and, and watching real proper, dangerous, crazy, incredible, brave man riding around the most dangerous street circuit in the world, well, the Isle of Man is perfect for you. If you have any questions about it in the meanwhile, then pop them in the comments. And when I do the episode about the TT, I will try and cover as much ground as I can.